Hey guys, how are you all doing today? Tao here, and we're back with a video that, you know, I, I should probably be uploading about now. It's been like freaking five days since I've uploaded a video. Anyways, I'm in B Bloons Monkey City, and the reason why I make this video, I would have done battles because that's what more people like, but Bloons Monkey City finally came out with this update. They came out like a week ago, but then it was broken, so now they brought it back, and here it is. Contested territories. Let's take a look at here. So, actually, hold on, wait. There was like a little pop up for where is it? Nope, that's not it. This is it. Introducing contested territory. Fight against five other cities. Actually, I don't even know why I brought this up. Contested territory. Basically, this is our thing. There's, there's like six of us here in a hexagon shape. Um, and right now, this little scrub here, he's winning it. Maybe not a scrub, I don't know. He's getting banana supplies. I don't even know what that means, but okay. And there's like this thing in the middle that we all do. One guy held it for 12 seconds, another guy for 22 seconds. Way to go, guys. Good job. This guy held it for 8 hours and 40... Or, actually, it's minutes. 22 minutes. 8 hours and 48 minutes. And his record is around 36. I don't know if that's easy to beat or to beat. I don't know, but... Whatever. I'm using my freaking supply drops, though, because... Hell yeah. Uh, that's obviously what you gotta do. And it's on the uh, cock map. So, well, chicken, of course. But rooster? I don't know. But it's on this. I had to beat round 37 or higher to gain control. So I don't know if that's easy or hard, but I'm still going to go for it. I'm not quite sure how many times I'm allowed to try this. And I don't know if, like, the balloons are extremely difficult or something. So let's go. Oh, it starts with the yellow. How nice. Uh, let's just get you here. Let's get a freaking ninja. These these guys can kind of work together. Ninja plus free dart monkey is usually pretty good. I don't know why they start with the yellow balloon, though. And I guess there's no point in going no eyes lost because you go until you die so yeah it's basically free play mode you go until you die so no eyes lost is basically pointless uh yeah i'm glad they match this up with people with similar city levels so i'm not like a, with the super op level 40 guy who i'll never have a chance against and i'm also not with a super underpowered uh level two guy who's like oh i just got my second dart monkey i'm so gonna win oh oh sorry dude but he's, yes, level 2 guy would not do well here. Although I'm curious, do they still have contested ter territory for low level people? I don't even know. Also, alright, screw the uh, road spiking here, I'm going to do pineapple. Much more cost effective. $25 instead of $30. Man, really rolling in that dough. Also, yeah, I wasted money getting a third banana farm because I decided to be greedy. Bad idea. Ah, oh, shoot, I might, uh, might even have to do this. Freaking double shot, man. Damn, I was hoping this guy would do a lot better, but nope, he's still leaking on me. Way to go, I'm just gonna place that. I know why Dark Monkey can't clean up all that. I should have higher expectations for the guy, but he's just not living up to standard. Only 112 pops? Yeah, not good enough. You should probably go back to school and learn how to pop better for your cost. I mean, I know it's the cheapest in the game, but it's it's, it's almost light flavor. Almost, but not really. So there was one round four. These are really freaking easy, I guess. This is actually kind of like the last one. There a couple videos ago I did this map, and it's fresh in my mind, so it's going to be pretty similar to that, I would think. And I'm pretty sure it's going to get all up to, like, DDTs and ZOMG rushes and that kind of stuff. It's going to be legitimately difficult. I'm not quite sure if I'll actually be able to handle it coming later rounds. We'll see. Round 37 still seems like a far ways away. So, here we go. Uh, if, like, for chance I, like, smash that record out of the water, I'm just going to go live commentary until I lose. That might take pretty much three hours and because you, know, you never know how far it can get and how long it takes i've not even touched this before so yeah but um so yeah if it does take like a long amount of time i'm probably gonna split up into multiple parts 30 minutes an episode is generally good 20 minutes 20 to 30 minutes per episode is standard yeah usually if i upload something longer that people lose interest then they'll be like yeah okay whatever so i'm gonna go with that Anyways, though, I already have six banana farms. I'm being way too greedy. Yep, there's freaking zebras out here right now. I should really, uh, look out. Here comes a power group of powerful balloons that might overwhelm your monk. Uh, <sighs> crap. All right, what should I do? Should I just sell, sell some farms I just recently got? Should I get, like, balloon shih tzu? Let's see. How many farms do I have to be sell? Sell this. I could sell two farms. And that's still not enough, damn it. All right, that's fine. Get you as well, and I can upgrade you. And I think this should be okay. I mean, a couple road spikes, and yeah, I'm already back to ground, or back to uh, 
Point zero. Yeah, way to go. Maybe I should have got running fire instead. I don't know. I'm not getting a mortar just for you. No, I'm, I'm using my pineapple. There we go. Good thing it wasn't a regal lead, because then I'd have to like, do some really crazy timing and hope it didn't get an instant regrow, because then I have to waste more pineapples. Yay. But at least I got this blue juice. Ah, you again? Really? Okay. At least I have a bunch of pineapples, so I can afford to keep doing that. So I know I should be extremely greedy, because I've already screwed up twice already. I've had to sell farms when they were premature, so maybe that won't repeat. I'm not too sure. I mean, Bloom Jitsu is good. It deals with camos too, and I can just keep doing pineapples for when the rare two leads come. So, I mean, I'm, I'm not having too many problems, but I'm having other kinds of problems. Level 10. I have no idea when the first Moab is either. I guess it's not level 6, so that's good. I should probably get a legitimate defense going. And by legitimate defense, I mean a second Bloom Jitsu. Well, maybe not yet. Should I be more greedy? <laughs> I really want to be more greedy and just get like more uh, two zero farms. I'm going to get one of them and now I'm going to stop being incredibly stupid. First I'm actually going to get a spike factory in the back. So one, this will do damage against mobs and two, I won't have to waste road spikes on leaking balloons. I only have to do them for like massive amounts of balloons. I, I also have two balloon stones so I can't exactly do the monkey boost, which kind of sucks to be honest. Monkey boost can really save your ass if you're being greedy. But I mean, I always have the ability to sell a bunch of farms for Maelstrom. I mean, I should be fine. Wait, Maelstrom? Maelstorm? I'm not too sure. Apparently, I'm very bad at pronouncing these things, so it's not even worth it sometimes. Right, let's get a few of these. Ooh, that is a lot of zebra balloons. Let's see how my uh, ninjas do. Oh, perfectly fine. Sweet. Yeah, once I get a second balloon jitsu, I should be perfectly fine. I just need to get something that pops camel leads in. Speak of the devil. These aren't camel leads, but they still are leads. They count as the devil. So, I guess I'll just do a few more pineapples. This is why I have pineapple buildings. And the only reason... Why are there so many pineapples? Can you please... Or, not pineapples. Why are there so many leads? Can you stop coming, please? I will pay you in pineapples if you stop coming. And I will pay you in pineapples if you keep coming. Oh my... They're like, oh, this guy doesn't have uh, lead power. So we're going to send literally 50 leads. Like, oh my gosh, can you just let me be lazy for one day? One day, please, that's all I ask. Alright, I think this should be the last of them, though. There we go, got them all. Wow, okay, thank you. No, no, that's not the last of them, okay. You know what? Fine, I see how it is. Screw you, Ninja Kiwi, for sending all those damn lies. I should have done that the whole time, but I wanted to spend pineapples. I wanted to practice my precision pineappling. And, yeah, that's, that's about it. So, would, does the game engine actually detect that? Like, it'd be pretty freaking cool if the game knows, like, oh, this guy's no lead popping power. Let's send him a ton of leads, because that's actually legitimately cool. As frustrating as that is, it's still pretty neat. I refuse to believe that all those leads in one round was random. Just out of my mind. Just what? How? I, I don't even get it. Just how? Alright, though. I'm expecting a huge difficulty ramp, though, because I've heard from some people that the free play rounds get really, really difficult, so... Yeah. Anyways, I guess, I mean, since I said I haven't made a video in, the, like, a, almost a week? Well, I haven't recorded a video in a week. I haven't uploaded a video in maybe five days or so. Like, the videos I uploaded last were actually recorded a couple days before, so it's actually been a while since I've been able to commentate. Yeah. And that's mainly because, well, been busy. Robotics, teaching assistant, math club, and I'm going to be going out of state soon and stuff with friends. Actually, quite a few things with friends and girlfriend. So that, that was all fun. Hopefully, I can get a bit of time tonight. Like, I mean, yeah, I'll, I'll have enough time for maybe like two or three videos and hopefully that can tide this over. So unfortunately, I won't really be able to keep my goal or like special thing of whatever I had. A video every day yeah unfortunately I really won't be able to keep that now just because how freaking busy I am honestly shit, the only goal I can make is upload videos as much as possibly can that's really all I have to say reroll that's not an issue absolutely zero issue right there all right now that I have a very substantial defense I really like my defense I'm gonna get a uh, banana Republic and just spam those don't have fourth tier farms yet but I did recently buy a bunch of fourth tiers I know I've ground zero so I'll use that for my aces, and basically, I'm just going to max out all of my towers to my, the best of my ability. 
I'm not quite sure what I do for Dormund, because I wish I got a uh, Super Funky Man Cold, but I think I do have Juggernaut, so that might not be too bad. I'm not too sure what would be better in this case, Juggernaut or Triple Shot. I mean, Juggernaut does a lot of damage, just does one damage against a lot of Moebs, but Triple Shot does three damage against four Moebs. So, yeah, maybe I'm thinking Juggernaut. Plus, it's more expensive, so obviously it's better. But yeah, if I had the Super Funky Man Cold, I would definitely go for that. And not a single Moab yet. Wave 17. Unless there's a really huge difficulty ramp, whoever held the previous record was not doing good. And they are very unfortunate to be up against this unstoppable army of banana farms, two ninjas, a ring of fire, and a mortar. Yeah, unstoppable army. The very, very unfortunate. I would hate to be them. Yeah, definitely would hate that so much. Indeed, yeah. We haven't even seen any ceramics yet. What what is this crazy crap? I I, I don't even know. Just, what? Yeah, that's true. We actually have not seen any ceramics. So that allows me to be extremely greedy with farms. But I would be fine against ceramics. The mobs would be the first thing to give me troubles. But I do have nice defense overall. I think I'm gonna go for a spike factory starting defense. Out or starting mob defense. I'm just liking that. Just get the spike factor up to Moab Shredder Spikes, leave it there, and that'll be my Moab defense. I, I could do that, yeah, I, I like that. <laughs> of course, it's not exactly needed yet, so yay! Um, I believe, well, I don't know. If Contested Territory got a, a difficulty ramp, then I probably won't be expecting to go to, like, round 100 plus or whatever. But I, I know, like, in the... 20 or 12 hours or whatever that it was up the first time people got to like round 200 which was just insane like or no there was like a round cap at round 20 202 or something that sounds about right round 202 there was a round cap so everybody got to there and it was just a contest who could get there first anyways first ceramics about time these are still really weak against blue ninjutsus and ring of fire combo and in the meantime i just maxed out all my farms yeah well, cost efficiency. I don't want to get two upgrades on the right because that is just not worth it. Absolutely not worth it. Whoa, that is a lot of ceramics. I might want to get another Ring of Fire. I'm not too sure. Let's find out. Will I be fine? Oh, yeah, I'm fine. A anyways, though, I before I overreacted, I'm, I was getting this uh, Spike Factor rip, so I can go for a uh, Moab Shredder defense against Moabs. Round 20 already. This is pretty freaking good. <laughs> I feel good about myself, even though these are the easiest rounds I've seen ever. Plus, this map is easy as well. I didn't actually get a close look at some of the rewards, though. I actually don't know what I could get for being super amazing. Yeah, I don't know. I think some of the uh, spikes are being eaten up by Lezzo, so I'm going to just upgrade that there. And in case like a DDT comes before webs, webs 2, I don't want to be... Entirely screwed over, even though I know that's 100% not happening. Good thing I have Spike Storm unlocked, though. That's always handy. So now what to get? Uh, let's get you, I suppose. There we go. That's good. I'll just leave you at that for now. Um, And now let's start getting that village. Where to get the village? Just gotta... Gotta have space. Or gotta be able to encapsulate, like, everything. Or a bunch of space. I'm thinking here's good. And now I can just start spamming Moab Maulers. I, good thing I have a couple super monkeys too, because I can spam sun gods and do really nicely with those too. High quality though, I just realized high quality, I can't place as much as I'd like to. I could have sworn this was a pop mode style, like uh, the monkey v monkey, but I guess not. That's fine by me though, I really don't mind at all. So, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go for you, Monkey Intelligence Bureau. So, Ice is banned here, I, I can't... Keep forgetting, Ice is banned. Is, what else is banned? Wizards? Well, they suck anyways. I don't even have that much upgrades for them, so I'm perfectly fine with them being banned. Oh, look, Camel Reroulettes. How cute. Uh, let's get more more. Oh, I thought I had Assassin already. Shoot. I was researching Assassin, but I guess I don't have it yet. That sucks. Alright, let's just get these up now. Oh, first Moab. About time. I have my Moab defense ready. It didn't even get to the Maulers, because Spike Swarm defense, or uh, Moab Shredder Spikes defense. That thing is just super awesome. Get so much money from these banana farms. I wish I had four two farms. That'd be sweet, but I, I don't. So I'm stuck with all these. I don't know. I, I, anybody have a sinking feeling? Oh, BFB. Anybody have a sinking feeling these bananas are illegal? Like illegally imported from like Puerto Rico or something? I don't know. I feel the monkeys just shouldn't have access to all these bananas. I don't know. It, it just has this scandalous feeling to it. 
Are the bananas illegal? We'll never know. But they earn me a lot of money, so I guess they must be illegal. Because nothing legal earns you that much money that fast. Yeah, that's what I'm going with. Perfect logic. Uh, five more wallers I can get to have range? Oh yeah, I definitely have range. I could also uh, get jungle drums too. I think I'll do that right now. And that is probably the best use of my village. Wait, there we go. Excellent. Excellent. I don't know if I'll legitimately be able to afford everything though, because eventually banana farm money will start becoming more and more, well, well, I mean, banana farm money will be good and all. It's just the rounds will get longer and more infrequent. I won't be earning money too fast. And I barely get any money from balloons. So maybe I could go for a monkey town. I don't know. Maybe not worth it. I don't think it's worth it. I'm just going to keep spamming all these towers that I possibly can and hope that does well. I'm also going to want to relocate this under the village so we get uh, the damage boost or whatever. Or no, attack speed boost. I'm dumb. And I'm pretty sure, yeah, pierce boost as well, just as plus one pierce, so that always helps. Look at these BFBs, though. I think this single spike factory is still taking down all these BFBs. It actually has a good amount of pops. That's pretty shocking. Yep, it, it is taking down BFBs like crazy. Wow, that thing is damn good. All right, two more bo bomb shooters to go. Still don't know why they call them that, but whatever. Round 26. So, yeah, I guess this is the difficulty curve. The first mob and first BFB came on the same round. How crazy is that? I guess pretty crazy. It's, yeah, crazy. So, I would think that EOMG and DDT would be soon to follow, but I have not seen either of those badasses. Show your face. Stop being a total puss. Just get your ass out here and do something. Anyways, I got all those. Um... Let's see, now the question is, do I want to get Spike Storm or 4-2 uh, Spike Factor? Because I know I have that unlocked, and that's really, really good. Trust me. Uh, I know those are good. Um, and I think I'm going to get an Arctic Wind. Oh, <laughs> no, they're freaking banned here. What am, I, what am I even talking about? Let's get a Super Monkey. I think Super Monkeys are the way they go. Right here seems like a good spot. It covers a lot of area, and it will cover more area once I upgrade the range, but Sun God. Sun God's a way to go. It has so much more popping power than a uh, Robo Monkey. Just overall, it does better against Moabs in the long run too. Because I'm, I have a feeling we're gonna get a lot of grouped Moabs and BFBs. I don't know why, but I feel we should. And of course, group Moabs that come from ZOMGs are pretty deadly as well. And of course, cleanup. Something, something's got to get rid of all those. Can't rely on a single Ring of Fire forever. Yeah, heck no. I gotta get that uh, Sun God. I gotta be able, gotta be sure to Maelstrom every now and then. Uh, that's got to come in handy. So here comes more BFBs. I'm just going to keep up the range with my mouse, by the way. I'm upgrading with my mouth because... Now with my mouth. But with my mouse. God, I have a lisp. It's bad. Um, because I'm a scrub, that's why. And that's obviously the best reason. And I, d I have a feeling this would happen. I'm running out of things to talk about, kind of. So I'm just... I'm, I'm just pointlessly rambling that's kind of what i do in all my videos anyway just pointless ramble and <laughs> maybe i can speed this up every now and then just so you hear like random squeaky voice and super fast music i don't know why but i don't know it'd be, it'd be kind of funny to uh your voice be squeaky actually i think you could just do that in youtube you can select two times viewing speed i don't know why they chose to do that but i'm so glad they did it's, it's, it's just a random really cool feature i love it absolutely love it uh, i can't even explain it but it's just so good but this is the first time mobs are starting to get through this mob Shrider Spikes just because they came out so early. Oh, this is a group to be a V-Rush, right? Oh yeah, this is multiple. I don't think my uh, Maulers can handle this alone. I'm going to sell you. I'm just going to Maelstrom every now and then. Uh, whenever needed. Is it going to be needed? I don't know. Let's, uh, let's get it right about now. Alright, Maelstrom. Let's just uh, clean this up. Yeah, that, that was a good time, Maelstrom. I only needed that one. can sell you back and get the Sun God pretty soon, because that is my... Oh, wow, okay. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to target you right at the beginning of the track, just so you can catch any red balloons. I decided to do that. Yeah, balloon jitsu distraction is good, but it's like one red balloon. That's all you need to get the next round going, and it doesn't do that. Oh, first DDTs. Those got destroyed. So DDTs come for ZOMGs. That is good to know. So I guess DDTs do have lower priority i suppose anyways first sun god though i'm still going for epic range because epic range is really nice this will just liquefy any spam because i have no need to get mass amounts of ring of fires now because that would have been my only other option how many more super monkeys can you get just one more 
Juan Moss, let's, uh, let's do that. Where to get you now? Well, I'm not quite too sure. Maybe... Oh, I gotta be able to afford it first. <laughs> DDTs, those things get vaporized. Too good, too good. Um... Maybe just right next to this first some god. I kind of like the positions of these. Oh, it's a ZOMG. About time. Old friend, good to see you. Round 32. So I just got to get to round 37. This shouldn't be hard. I have all these Moimars and Sun God and stuff. It's pretty nice. Plus, if I have to, don't think I will, but if I absolutely have to, I can always sell farms and stuff. This is a time, though, I really wish I had four two farms, though, because when you're limited on farm mounts, all you can do is just upgrade and get the best money per round you possibly can. Because I'm starting to buy things pretty slowly. It's taken me whole round and a half, well, two rounds or so to buy some god. Actually, how much money am I earning per round? So, I think it's 13 bananas, right? Oh, 25 bananas. Oh, wow, okay. So, 750 per farm. 25 times 30, 750. All right, 1,500, 3,000. Oh, wow, only 4,500 per round? Wow, that's actually pretty trash. That's enough for me to afford it. This is Blasma Blast, and that's not even good. I need a Sun God. I need a second Sun God so I can just rape everything. And then I can get go on and probably 4-2 Spike Fact... Well, no, I'm going to go for 2-4 Spike Factories. I have all the balloon cleanup I could possibly need for now. Probably. I don't know. But yeah, Spike Storm is where it's at. That, that is always really nice. I think this one might be my first. I'm not too sure. Yeah, I, I, I have to make decisions somehow. But of course, as expected, this is going longer than usual. Uh, 21 minutes. This is about the time that I would usually finish kicking the ass on this cock map. I mean, it, it, it's obviously it's a cock. I mean, here's the neck, head, and then here's the whatever you call them on top of the cock's head. So, yeah, that's normal. And yes, every normal person calls them a cock. Trust me, I am normal and call them that. Therefore, every normal person calls them a cock. Yes, so much logic right there. Okay, two ZMGs this round. That's, that's nice. Um, hopefully I should be fine. I don't see myself having any problems. I can afford a Maelstrom if I need to. Although, I mean, the cost of selling one, maybe two farms will be enough to Maelstrom for sure. For sure. My Sun God's on first just so it can clean up any ceramics that get relatively far. So yeah, I mean, it had a bit of an issue this time. And a little bit of lag, but I mean, it's not like lagging. It just feels like it's skipping frames a bit. It's hard to explain. I look, more DDTs. Oh, shoot. Wow, okay. Maulers actually do worse against those than I thought. Wow. Wow, okay, so I, I only realize now how important my spike factories actually were against these DDTs. Wow, I did not even realize that. Okay, so that took a legitimate amount of time. Alright, round 35 though, we can't uh, fuck up now. We cannot let this go to waste. We put so much effort in here and get second Sun God so soon, probably after next round. We've already repeated two ZMGs before though, so this should, shouldn't be anything new at all. That should be really, really easy. Alright, there's that. And all to BFBs. Yeah, buddy. Alright, Sun God. And more Sun God. Dude, I, I, I don't even... <laughs> I, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna die before round 50. I'm just calling it. Because that seems likely. That is a lot of DDTs. Please slow down or something. Uh, okay. Wow, that scares me every time, because they get so damn far. I'm like, Sun God, please do better. Okay, second Sun God, this might help out. Oh, that helped out tremendously, holy crap. Because they like they, they have three beams instead of Plasma Mon Monkey's one. I know these technically do fire a bit slower than the Plasma Monkey, but I don't care. Three beams is still better than one, and it still pops a lot. Uh, two more ZOMGs again. This should be extremely easy now. <laughs> And all we have to do is beat the next round, I think I'll have it, right? Yeah. Yeah, I, I think so. That's probably how it works. It is pretty cool, though, to see every now and then the Sun God's beams actually get overwhelmed for a short amount of time. That's... I don't know. I, ju I just find it mildly arousing. I, well, not... Ar yes, arousing. <laughs> I was going to say not arousing. I'm like, nah, sure, I'll go with it. Oh, look, these BFBs are... Or not... Nah. If these DDTs are getting pretty far, stop getting far. Nobody likes you, DDTs. All right, let's get a Spike Storm. I think it'll just have to be this one, so I can Spike Storm whoever I want when the DDTs come in. Whoa, one, two, three, four, ZOMGs. Oh, my. Um, you know what? Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get you so I can just do this. 
Uh, maybe that helped? Maybe not. I'm gonna sell you so I can get it again. There we go. Okay, I was able to afford it too, that's nice. Alright, let's do that. And hopefully that should be good. I don't know. I really wish I knew. But I don't. I'll, I can Maelstrom really easily if I have to. But damn, that's a lot of BFPs. Just, you know, that's 16 BFPs. Well, some of them are gone now, but it was 16 BFPs. And that's, what, 64 mobs and 256 ceramics? Yeah, so that's a lot of things. That is a lot of things. Oh my gosh. Um, Alright, screw you. I'm Maelstroming. I don't even care at this point. Let's get a second Maelstrom going. Uh, now the first one's ended, and holy crap, that was so many balloons. I had to sell two farms for that, that's not good. But hey, I, I think I beat the record now. Congratulations, you now control the territory. Go as far as you can and stay on top. 